What's going on, guys? Welcome to a, uh, a kind of a new survival game. It came out about a month ago, uh, but it wasn't working too well when I first played it. But it's pretty much a survival game. It's a little bit more original in nature. You still have to eat, drink, etc. Uh, there's like pirates will try to attack this boat that you can upgrade, and it's called Landless, obviously, and there's no land at all. You, you drive around on this boat that you can upgrade, defend against pirates, a few other things like that, so it's pretty cool. Uh, we're going to hop in and just give it a go. If you guys want to see more, please let me know. Otherwise, we'll probably just do this as a one-off episode until you guys uh, feel like... I don't want to lose food and hunger while I'm talking. Uh, or food and thirst. So, if you want to see more, please let me know. And uh, we'll continue the game until it pretty much gets boring or stops getting viewership. And that's kind of how things are going to crumble. Don't worry, Stranded Deep and Iced are coming back very soon. Uh, Stranded Deep, I had a problem where an update on my PC deleted the save file. And Iced, I just wanted to wait a bit and, like, do it again later. So, that's what we're doing. Uh, we're going to hop into this game now. So, transition begins. Hey, kid, wake up. That was one hell of a storm. Can't believe you made it out. Uh, press left alt to toggle your mouse cursor. Okay, that's nice. Uh, and click on flashing icons to learn more about the world around you. I've got a Christian shop we're running now. Hopefully, uh... I'll be here every step of the Echo Tech headquarters. Go to the front of the boat and press F to start the boat. Uh, the encryption stuff we're in. Okay, so we're good here. Right? There we go. I pressed the wrong button. Check mark. Boop. Whoa, kid, that doesn't sound good. Looks like you're going to have to rebuild the engine. Hey, kid. Uh, I'm not a child, okay? Look at your your ugly ass beard. Uh, now, this, now, now is not the time to be lazy. Go use the material. I stash in your inventory. Go to the workbench. Left click F, uh, and then uh, and then craft an engine. Okay, we craft an engine. Yes. All right. So we should be able to with the parts we have to craft an engine. So we can do left alt craft machinery basic engine craft. So it seems like this like rarity is based on color, just like you would see in like an MMO. So that's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and craft ourselves the engine, and then we need to place that engine on the boat in order to make it run. I did play the game a little bit just to figure it out to see, like, the basics of it. That way we don't, like, look like a complete doofus. Um, oops. I need to put the engine right here. There we go. So now we need to head to this new area. This, uh, so you see right ahead of us is, like, this kind of like islands that they've, that they've crafted. Not really an island, it's more of like like a dock with a whole bunch of buildings. And when you go to these docks with a whole bunch of buildings, you can you can like look around for like materials and a few other things of that nature. And you can upgrade your boat and get new things. And eventually I believe we do start to get attacked by pirates where we need to have guns in order to kill them before they like take down our ship. As you can see, like the hole has HP top, uh, top left. And then we also have uh, Buoyancy, which I assume is like if our ship starts to sink, that's going to go down. And then obviously fuel we get from doing these types of things. Uh, thirst and hunger, I believe I actually have a little bit of food and water to start. Yeah, I got some potatoes and some water. I got some pistol ammo. I got myself a pistol. I got an axe. I got a crowbar. I got a wrench and I got a hammer. So we're going to hold on to all of these things as well. And I can go around this town killing people, but it doesn't do anything. I was messing around earlier, and it seems like he doesn't really do much, so... So we're just gonna go up here, park, and we should be able to find, like, a salesman in order to buy materials that we may need for our adventure. Also, this happens every once in a while. You need to, like, save and, like, update and stuff. So he's just telling us that we should go scouting around and find some materials and then head back to the boat once we find some stuff, so... Boop, 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 boop. This is the pistol. I kind of like the animations and how the pistol feels. Hello there. I like to buy some stuff. So you can see bottles of water. So oil is the money. Uh, it's whale oil. And whale oil is like the, the currency because everybody needs oil to run their ships around the area. Uh, I don't think I really need any of this. You can, you can build houses and stuff too, which is pretty sweet. Um... I don't think I need any of this stuff. Alright, what do I do? Just walk away, right? Yeah, just walk away. So, if we go around the city, uh, we can actually look around for these, like, chests. So, here's one. And we can take all. And you do get, like, a lot of stuff from the chests. So, that's what we're going to do instead of buying things. I need to be careful because there is fall damage. No chests in here. Okay. 
Any chests? Any chests? I'm not sure what those things on the left are. I think they might be quests, but I'm not really sure how to activate them. So let's go back down. So we're just going to go to the top of each of these buildings to just get some, some extra materials. So this is the axe, the crowbar, the wrench, and the hammer. So supposedly you can find black boxes to unlock like really cool stuff. So this is Terminal Echotech mainframe 66 or 660X. Uh, we've been using it to decrypt hidden knowledge. That's why you see an Echo Tech around here. Come back with a black box and I can get you what's inside. So I assume like if you find black boxes or like you kill pirate ships or like you just find them around the area, you can come back here and like find some goodies. Looks like this guy sells some stuff too. Biofuel, refuel the boat. We have 12. Oh, should I buy? Yeah. Wait, so that's 360 ounces? Oh, that was a huge waste. Can we sell stuff? Oh shit, we can sell stuff. Oh wow, that sells for a lot. But he doesn't have that much oil, so we can't possibly sell that to him anyway. Okay. So we found a whole bunch of oil just by going chest to chest. And we need to make sure we go every and find every chest. All the graphics on this game aren't that great. From what I heard, I mean, oh. I want payback for those wasters. Uh, did to my family at home. Tied and burned alive in my home and was forced to watch them all laughing. Wow, avenge my family and I'll give you something you should have used a long time ago. Alright, so I assume that's a... some kind of quest, but I'm not really sure where to find my quests. Maybe they just show up on the map. I'm not sure. Okay, so let's go ahead and on down. I assume the game is going to instruct us in some way on how to do specific things that we don't know how to do yet, obviously. So, like, what's going on here? It's like a boat in progress, it looks like. Can't get over there. Can't do anything with this. Can't really do anything over here. Okay. I'm also a chick, by the way. Don't think I pointed that part out yet. By the way, the only thing I'm covering up is the, the mini-map, and if that's important, we will be sure to uh, fix that in the future. It looks like we can't hold on to this stuff. So let's see what we can get rid of. Oh, that's worth a lot. So I can't carry it. I mean, it's not a huge issue, right? Is this like a kiln? Something. Hey, buddy. Sharks, sharks, sharks. Everywhere I go, I see these beady-eyed beasts lurking. Waiting for me to go into the water. I haven't swam for years because of the fear of sharks. If you could take out the whole neighborhood of sharks, I'll give you something. Okay. I'm down. So it seems like scrap metal and scrap wood I can't grab right now because I'm full on inventory. Oh, we are... We need to be more... Oh, how did that do fall damage? Question. Did it? It did do fall damage. Okay. You know, fall damage in water. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, have we gone to every house? I don't think we've gone to these ones or those ones. Hello? Welcome. What do you have for sale? All the shit that I already have. Okay. Some stuff up here. I think it's right click to close. Just trying to still get used to the uh, the inventory. Oh, there we go. Take all. I just want to make sure I get everything. We won't be doing this in every town. We'll just do it when we need stuff. I just want to try to get everything we can possibly grab before we start like heading out. Why is there a car? Oh. Uh. Who are you? Ow! Ow! Okay, yeah, they're shooting me. Fuck. You. Bitch. So we're gonna have to go out on our boat and probably take those guys out. I think that buoy out there is like where they... where they reside from. Pretty sure you just shot me. Alright. What do you sell? What are you selling? Nothing? Okay. Let's go on... Uh, please jump. Nothing up here. Okay. Lame. So, they want me to also take out sharks, but I'm not seeing any sharks. Maybe he just wants to kill a certain number of sharks. Alright, so nothing's in here. Nobody's selling anything in here, so let's go on upstairs. Okay. And there's one more house we gotta go to, and then we're gonna hop back on our boat here. 
in just a moment. So they're selling something here. Seems like everybody kind of sells the same thing. Pretty much, so... But each one has their own amount of money that we can get for selling stuff, so... When we go to a new place, we'll probably go around selling stuff if we need money. So our oil, we're gonna need to drink and eat real quick, actually. So it's six, and then seven. There we go. So when we eat, we actually lose thirst. Let's go swim on out to my boat. That's how we get back on. We go around to the ladder. Alright, so we're gonna go take out those pirates, I think. I think that's what we want to do anyway. From what I say. It's about to be nighttime as well. I wonder what nighttime's gonna look like. There's like something going on out here. I assume these pirates are gonna be out and about. The ones on the dinghy. Oh. That's some cool music, dude. Is that a shark or is that just water reflection? I'm not really sure. Oh, there they are. Killed one. Okay, his body's floating away. Maybe if we aid no, ADSing doesn't really seem to help too much. I don't think I can shoot that far with this weapon. Let's get a little closer. Alright, kid, take a good look. That is an Echotech MK5 research beacon. My top student before the Great Flood designed the mechanism using electric water displacement and early anti-gravity prototyping uh, to keep it completely buoyant. The surface of the water, yet immovable as it anchored down. He named it Anchorless Technology. It's basically an immovable ocean surface satellite, but I digress. Uh, these things are incredibly tough. I advise you to conserve your bullets and focus on pulling apart with your crowbar or hack it with an axe. I know it's going to take longer, but you'll be trying to pry the thing open and send a stress signal, and oh boy, you're going to need every last bullet for each damn salter, waster, and echo drone heading your way. Destroy the beacon to stop the signal and collect the black box. The signal must be stopped in order for drones and pirates to stop coming, as well as you clear and secure the area. Crap, Captain's on to me. I don't have a lot of time left. I need, you, uh, need to try and throw him off my scent. I'll contact you uh, when you get the black box uploaded. Static transmission ends. Okay, so that's not good. So we got like, this is our main quest. We need to get this black box, but we need to break it down with a crowbar, I suppose. Can we just shoot it? I'm just gonna shoot it, personally. I have a lot of ammo from running around the city. Kid, uh, kid, I think we can save the world. Transition begins. I'm compiling the database of blueprints and guides to send over to get the essentials covered. I'm also sending the final version of the world image regenerative encryptor, or as I like to call it, Wire. Wire takes all the data collected from the black box and processes them to trans notable, uh, translatable code. As you collect more and more data, Wire will be able to construct a detailed map of the world narrowing down the Echo Tech. Have, uh, all right, uploading, gunshot, Captain Moistland, this is not what you think. I should have known the self-righteous, self-important professor. You selfish cur. Uh, maybe you should investigate your work. You know, the little dogs. Uh, pistol whip. Ah, uh, he got pistol whipped. Ow. As for you, I gave you everything. Food, water, comfort, security, and knowledge. And this is how you repay me. Uh, you could be the great queen of our marriage, but it looks like a professor has some corrupting your mind and silly adventures of fairy tales. You want to see the real world. You won't last a week out there. I will get you back dead or alive to the end of the earth. You will be mine. Kid, my job's done. I've taught you everything I can. It's up to you. The world now rests in your hands. Don't let anybody stop you. Uh, upload complete. Static transmission ends. Okay. So that was like the, the beginning tutorial, it seems like. I kind of like how it's like a survival game with a story. Did I get the Did I get the black box? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Looks like I need to drop something. Uh, is 
Is anyone picking this up? I need help. A shark took my baby away. A blue market lead in contract turn and will appear on your minimap anywhere. Press L to see your contract log. Oh, I didn't even know that I had a contract log. Can I... Can I... I can't... Okay. Let's see. Let's see if we can drop something or if we have, like, storage. I think we have storage on our boat, right? If we go here... So we refilled our boat all the way. And we still have crap. Storage! Ha! There we go. This is what we needed. We don't have rifle or a shotgun yet. And we don't need any of these. I think we're full on inventory on those anyway. We'll throw these in here too. Okay. Now we'll go get the black box. Awesome. I'm afraid of sharks a little bit, so... Would prefer not to deal with sharks. Alright, so let's go on. So L is, yeah, so shark extinction, all this other stuff. Okay, so I think these are long-term goals for, like, really good stuff. Like, this guy gives you an MP5. If you kill 200 of those dudes, kill 200 sharks, you get that. And then this dude is uh, going to give me a whole bunch of other stuff. I don't know what that is, but we need to, like, go on a map and find where the said shark uh, took the baby. Like, it's like a dingo took my baby, but sharks. Which is funny. Okay. I think even somebody in the town made like a harpoon joke. I was talking to people around the town. Uh, and it said, uh, I used to be an adventure like you until I took a harpoon to the knee. So they have a couple little funny Easter eggs around in this game too. So far, not bad. Not bad. I'm not going to lie. I don't mind the game too much. It's pretty cool. I thought I saw it talking about a figuring way to explore the ocean floor. There should be many, so many treasures down there. True, true. You're not wrong. All right, so we should be able to bring this, this said black box back here, right? Here you go. Hope you got what you needed. Thanks for the nothing. Okay, so I guess that gave us tech. Does tech allow us to upgrade our boat? Let's go check. I'm curious. I'm assuming that's how it works. So let's go onto our boat. Let's go over here to craft. Force rate, amplify water. That's our stats. So we can cook food here. Crafting, so... Sonar buoy. So we gotta get solar panel. So it hits a wrench to detect objects in the area. So that's pretty cool. And then there's an intercept tower. Hit with a wrench to hack a nearby vessel. Automatically shoots at enemies. So we need to like work on getting processors and stuff. So wooden windows. I assume we can build like a base or maybe build something on here. Batteries need processors. So how do we build processors? Select the blueprint and the list to start crafting. I have no auxiliaries. Pipes, wires, brackets, ammo, processor. Scrap metal, scrap electronics. So we can make a whole bunch of those. Well, lightning, wood planks, storage chests. There's a whole bunch of cool stuff that we can actually get. So, yeah. Thank you guys for swinging by today's episode. I uh, appreciate the support on all of the series that I do. If you guys want to see more, please leave a like and comment down below. And uh, maybe we'll continue this game. I kind of might continue the game anyway. It seems a little original. The gameplay is okay, but I think the story could be pretty cool. And I assume we can, like, beat the game necessarily. So, uh, yeah, again, if you guys want to see more and uh, the game does well enough, like I said, we'll continue. Leave a like on the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.